Welcome back, uh, Aries. Uh, welcome to your reading for the month of March. We're going to jump straight into it and check what's in store for you. I'm going to draw up to 11 cards. And then Right, Aries. Um, energy for the month uh, uh, for the month of uh, March will be. Uh, it seems like you will have. Uh, seems like you are going to have some kind of uh, a battle with uh, within your uh, within yourself. Uh, it just feels like you're bat uh, battling some kind of uh, thoughts, and uh, so it just seems like the whole month of March you will pretty much uh, think about uh, uh, doing something. Not necessarily you will do it uh, because the circumstances will not let you. Uh, again, it's very important for you to just stay aligned with your with your thought process. But uh, it's very significant card uh, fight basically. Fight within yourself. Fight with. Uh, fight within your mind. Fight within your soul. Um, so it's sort of like a decision making kind of time in in the month of March for yourself. Um, in terms of, uh, uh, it seems like in terms of. Uh, uh, you will leave something behind, uh, like uh, in terms of uh, February, you will be very, very happy that you left some kind of energy or someone behind you. Uh, so I don't know if you made some kind of decisions in order to move forward in the month of February, but that's how it sort of uh, resonates with uh, myself and with uh, with the energy. You left it and now you're ready for the March and you're ready for the new uh, upbringing and the new energy shift. So that's what you're going to have in the March of uh, um, in March. Uh, <clears throat> there will be some kind of significant um, idea, or someone will give you some kind of uh, significant idea um, in terms of uh, in terms of the new work or new possibilities. Um, again. To get the most out of it, I think you will need to just communicate with a person also on certain level. There will be loads of information. Like I can, I can sense loads of information coming your way, um, and it's very important for you to just stay aligned with uh, with your with your thoughts. Don't let the other person dictate you what you should or you shouldn't do. So that's what I get from from that card. Okay. Um, uh, giving away, giving away. Um, it seems like, in terms of spirituality and in terms of your uh, your mind body balance, um, I think it's very significant to uh, uh, the, the the month of March for yourself in terms of your mental your mental state. Um, again, I would keep it quite uh, simple in terms of your mind. Uh, don't uh, overdo work. Uh, again, try to divide work and your home life and then your spiritual life. Okay, meditate, uh, do Reiki. I mean, like, just try to uh, relax as much as you can in terms of your mind. It just the whole month is pretty much just seems to me like you will have quite a lot of uh, quite a lot of uh, battles within yourself. Um, like you will try to do one thing, but again, it will uh, it will be stopped because you will have to do something else. So just just be mindful that uh, that might not be exactly what you expect um, in the mar in the month of March. Okay. Um, number eight, blue eight. Um, you have to be just uh, quite mindful of uh, of. Um, uh, like in general, yes, I, I know that it will be quite busy mind in terms of, as I said before, like in terms of your mind and your spirit and your soul. Uh, but again, I think uh, it will be quite happy ending at the end of the March. Pretty much, I can sense that you will have quite significant shift of uh, energy. And um, again, I think it will be someone bringing you some kind of message or someone bringing you some kind of uh, uh, possibilities, and you will have to act upon it uh, straight away. Okay, so that's in terms of the the actual spread for the for the for the for the March. Again, I think it will be in general quite uh, quite busy month for yourself. Uh, Aries. Uh, now, getting back into uh, additional cards. Uh, 
again it will be there will be quite a lot of creativity within you you will try to um, you will try to create new things uh, again new projects will come your way again you you will be quite busy in the month of March that's what I can sense in here um, again it all depends uh, who this uh, reading resonates to but I, I, I can sense like the majority of you you will have quite some something kind of new happening to you and it's perfect I think I think it's going to be very good again just try to know how how to relax or when to stop and just say to yourself oh it's me time now and I need to relax my mind a bit okay so just don't forget to meditate and to do your own uh, your own things which you do for, for relaxation um, again you're going to work with a, some kind of team or some kind of a big team um, and you will need to show them the, the how it is uh, being done and I think it's sort of you're very passionate and dynamic person Aries and I think it's very very important for you to um, to show it to others okay so that's what I can sense from from that card um, um, in terms of the relationships in the March of uh, in March uh, you will need a balance and uh, and you will have to be a bit withdrawn okay so you um, you will have to work as a as a one uh, with your uh, with your spouse or with your partner uh, or someone who you see uh, there will be like the, your other half i can sense that your other half will not accept you doing your stuff and they are doing their own stuff you will have to do it together okay well, that's what relationship is for um, you will wait for some kind of ideal moment to say something or to do something. Weird enough, I can I can sense like it might be a proposal or it might be something like next stage in your relationship. Um, again, um, just do it. Uh, maybe try to get rid of the work first and then um, and then just uh, just do just have a lot of time for that person in the, in, the, in the month of March. Okay. Um, uh, there are some kind of worries in regards to the money. Um, Again, I think you've got uh, you're you're very passionate about what you do, and that passion will bring you the the money anyway. I can't sense that you will sort of have a stoppage or a blockage of uh, of not receiving. Um, if you're thinking about going into self-employment, uh, try to maybe. Um, uh, check the check the fields first, or check the how it uh, how it might be created. Don't just jump straight into it and leave your your work uh, your workplace at the moment. I don't think it will be beneficial for you. Okay. Um, um, yeah. The, um, there will be in terms of the new uh, new opportunities, uh, Aries. Um, there will be some kind of um, so you will stop this project um, um, and then you will think that oh you, you need another challenge and I think you're gonna but you, I think you will not be able to do that new challenge just on your own or on yourself within yourself you will need other people to do it with you so you're gonna be part of a bigger team your next team will be I think it might be even bigger than the ones uh, the, the one which you are at, uh, with at the moment. Um, I've got weird feeling, and that's why I can sense from the from the from this card that it's uh, you will have quite a lot of uh, help from outside. Again, that's what I said in regards to the Zen cards. It it uh, resonates with with them pretty much the same. Um, um, the things will get better. Okay, uh, so just don't uh, please don't stress over it, Aries. Uh, it's going to be fine. You're going to be just fine. Um, if uh, you are battling some kind of um, mind thoughts, or or let's say you're uh, just just, um, it's gonna be all okay. Okay, you're gonna go through it. Uh, you will need help from other people, and uh, please don't stop to speak to your other half about it, and to your closest people, uh, your friends, your family. Uh, they will be able to help you majorly with your, with your, with certain things which you've got in your mind. Um, they will be able to direct you and point you in the right direction, Aries. Okay. Um, in terms of the again work, okay, work. Um, there, it's not ideal to change your work at the moment okay it will be not right time not right place and um, that's why I can get from this card and um, 
learn first a lot of things which you need to learn in order to start that new job and feel comfortable with it and then after you finish that whole process um, you're gonna be shown a way forward okay so at the moment I would uh, uh, I would suggest you staying in your in your current environment and then on the side just to get as much knowledge as you can but I can see you in the March I can see you um, working uh, within your head and your knowledge like you're gathering some kind of inform sorry information and um, you're gonna have certain people uh, around you who uh, might again as I said at the beginning it might not be genuine but it's just them don't uh, don't uh, resonate with them okay just let them be and let them do whatever they want to do um, in general uh, let me just pull up yeah again it will be a month of creativity for you uh, Aries it is uh, you're gonna be very very busy extremely busy and um, you're gonna have people who love you and who will try to help you let them um, and again there might be a proposal on the way as well okay Thank you very much, very much, Aries, for the uh, for this month's uh, reading. I hope you've enjoyed it, and I shall see you next week. Thank you. Bye.